This is the first over-the-air update for 2024 Evoque. Given that Range Rover does not have a good reputation on electronic hardware and software, I waited for almost a week to make sure that I have ample time to troubleshoot in case something went wrong. My initial setup of the in-control app was not exactly smooth and I have to call the dealer to have them reset the system. I also have to set up a new account with Range Rover before the setup can be completed successfully. This update is supposed to take 40 minutes, so I started the update at night and went back to check on the update in an hour or so. I checked on the software update in the infotainment system and it indicated that the update was completed with no issue. Before the update, the in-control remote function did not seem to work and the update did help fix that. I open the app and the home page showing vehicle information is working fine. Then I go to the remote function and tried locking the door and it works even though it takes a while for the instruction to be sent to the vehicle. Then I also tried the remote beeping and flashing function to help owners find their car. It took even longer but that works as well. Other functions, like the GPS location of the car, vehicle status, etc. all seems to be working fine. So I will call this update a success. If I have to be picky, the email instruction sent to me still uses the older model with smaller and dash screen as a demo. That should be updated to provide better instructions and user experience.